Early April 2013, the first Thomas Cook Airbus 321-211 with the serial number MSN5603 is ready for final assembly in Hamburg Finkenwerder. Components have been built all over Europe. They come to Hamburg to be meticulously assembled and tested. Every rivet needs to be exactly in place. The components of the A321 have been produced in Germany, the UK, France and Spain. The main part of the fuselage, including the cockpit, is produced in France. The Thomas Cook Project 321 GO started three years ago. The Airbus is due for delivery in May. It should take off in June. At first, the fuselage is assembled at Station 41. The aircraft is taken shape. Using cutting-edge technology in the Airbus plant, precision and teamwork play an important part. At station 40, the so-called marriage takes place, the assembly of the wings. After having installed the landing gears, the Airbus stands on its own feet for the first time. At station 35, the tail plane and vertical tail, as well as the booster APU are being installed. In total, about 3 million single components are used for the Airbus 321. The Thomas Cook project team, coming from all markets of the Thomas Cook airline segment, actively accompanies the construction progress in Hamburg. The vertical tail is produced in Germany, whereas the tail plane is fabricated in Spain. As soon as all components have been assembled, they are tested. Everything inside the Airbus, from the lighting system to the leak-proof tank, as well as the communication and navigation system. Then, the lavatories get installed the panelings and interior equipment. Now, the overhead compartments and seats. In total, 215 seats are built in and wired. They have been designed and manufactured by Recaro, especially for Conda and Thomas Cook. They are extra light, so the Airbus saves weight and fuel. Now the Airbus 321 is assembled and ready for outside varnishing. Let's see in our next episode how the Airbus construction continues.